RD Logistics Fresh South Africa Managing Director Etienne Julia explains that the new RD Logistics Warehouse has two separate sections for chilled and ambient fresh produce. In these premises, in this warehouse, the, we have uh, about 5,000 pallet spaces in chilled and about 7,000 pallet spaces in ambient. So two sections separated from each other. The construction process of the new warehouse took 16 months to complete. Julia explains the process. The decision actually to build the warehouse from fresh came uh, from, from scratch, came from, uh, from a study of uh, retrofitting current ambient warehousing into chilled or going, uh, going new, which finally was the decision made. And once the decision was made in September 2014, then selection of lands, uh, developers, uh, was, uh, was done. And from there, the design of the building uh, took about two months, two to three months. And then the actual uh, start of the building uh, was in November for a handover and final key exchange uh, that happened in April. 2015. Uh, so the actual building time is, uh, is about six months. Idea Logistics is also investigating the possible implementation of voice-assisted picking technology. We are not yet sure if we're going to install it in, uh, in South Africa. We are making the studies because it's uh, some of the technical capabilities we have from overseas. Uh, then the principle is quite quite simple. You got a, a mechanical voice from a box that actually says the guy on the floor that he needs to go to this place and collect two pieces of this product which is there and then the guys once he picks it just says okay I've picked this is the quantity this is the, the product so you make a quality check on the quantity the guy picks at the same time that you check the reason uh, at which he picks and you do all of that automatically so we are looking at possibility to implement it here with uh, looking as well into the barrier languages and the difficulties specific to, 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 to South Africa or to our operations here. So we are not yet determined if we're going to put it in or not, but we're looking into it.